Hello everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel. In today's video, I will show you that how to split text in Excel. Right? How to split text in Excel. So let's go to our example. So we have some text values over here, just like you can see here. We have some text values over here. Hello, America, India and Japan. So what is basically in this particular example we have to do that uh, this is a text value, right? We need to split H E L L O like in this manner we need to retrieve the value from a cell o oh sorry o so we need to build a formula which will automatically retrieve these text values into the into these cells right so for that we will use mid function so before mid function i want to show you one more function that is called uh, in this section I will tell you that that is column function this is column function this one C O L U M N and you can see that return the column number of a reference let's suppose you have just open bracket and close bracket then it has just written me the value 4 why it has given me the value of 4 because this is 1 2 3 and 4 right in similar manner if I will just type here like column and I will select this one so this is my first column it doesn't matter if I'll click here click here anywhere in this particular column it will return me a one value right and similar manner if I'll just type here column and select in this part and close the bracket then it will give me 16 values because if you will count this column from start to this part then you will see that the column value is 16 and if I simply go here and type here column and open bracket and close bracket it will give me the the current column value which we have selected right in this manner we are getting the values from the column so I am just showing this function to you because I just want to include this function into this particular function which I am going to build but uh, so that is why I have shown you this function because you should have the knowledge of this function a second function which I am going to use the mid function so I have used the mid function over here so you can see that written the character from the middle of a text string given a string position and length so it, the name also suggests that it will just retrieve the mid value of the any text however we can manipulate it in a different manner and we can get the left and right value as well but normally it will retrieve the as per the this uh, text or this uh, intelligence you can see the written the character of the middle of text so we will use mid function and column function in order to get the values from this text so first of all I will use the mid function right so first criteria is the text this is a text start number if I type here one and number of character how many characters we need number of characters we need one character so now you can see that this is hello if I'll just freeze it and drag it like this it has given me a 4 value so now I will type here 2 now you can see that it has given me it written the E again I will just drag it like this I will type here 3 E right same manner if I drag it like this and I am just changing only one value right so you can see that I am changing only one value that is this part this part I am just changing that is start number so what will if we will use column function instead of uh, this uh, manually we are just entering the values if we will enter the column function manually over here then it will automatically retrieve the values right so we will going to implement that I'm going to delete this function simply type here mid and text value should be this freeze it uh, uh, by pressing F4 comma start number start number should be our column function column function we will use the reference we will give from this part because our first value will be 1 then 2 then 3 this is the column number 1 2 3 something like that right so it doesn't matter whether we will click here here anywhere as I have already shown in a previous example so I'm I can click anywhere in this particular column because we need one value close the bracket then how many characters we need because we want to extract only one value then this is the one 
close bracket and that's all and you can just uh, just uh, drag it like this in the right hand side same manner if I just so now you can see that we have it is because this we have freeze this value so what we can do we can freeze press F4 so now we have a middle of the section dollar this dollar part you can see that C dollar four let's check it oh no I think in, in initial stage we need to use this is a freezing concept and just drag it like this okay so drag it like this control R or you can drag it like this and drag down right so you can see that America we have A M E R I and then you can also drag it because in this particular uh, text we have more values or more text so you can drag it like this so and if I'll just resize this column like this so now you can see that all the values has been extracted suppose I'm just uh, type some other word that is like hello word let's learn something right so this is a very uh, the length of this text is uh, higher than these values and it, it has it contains some spaces as well and if I drag it like this then you can see that okay what happened <laughs> okay, okay because we have not dragged the formula over here right if I drag it like this control D or you can simply select it and just drag it like this you can see that we have hello world hello so hello after hello we have a space so that is why it is contained the hello and you can drag it till we will not get our complete text okay so now you can just resize these columns then we would be able to see entire value in a single page or single okay just resize it like this this one is okay then drag it like this then you can see here that hello then we have a space so that is why there is a space word that is word let's then space again then learn then something so in this manner if you have this kind of uh, uh, like uh, scenarios where you have to extract the values from any particular text then you can use this functionality and you can see that the formula is very simple there is a mid then to select the text and column value which I have already just told you know, uh, in this example that how to use the column function and the value we need only one so in this manner you can split the entire text right and if you want to need in, uh, only one value and you can use if an else condition as well if you need something else so in this way you can just split the text from uh, uh, separate the text using the split function or the mid function so I hope you would like this video thank you for watching have a nice day